There are browser extensions such as the WAVE Accessibility Evaluation Tool that can help you assess things like alt text on a website, but you can also do it right in the browser using the code. Here are two ways you can do this. If you pick any image on a website in the Google Chrome browser, you can right click on it and say inspect. This can inspect any element of the web page, and if you right click on it, it will take you directly to the part of the code that shows that image. So you don't really have to understand the full page structure of the HTML to understand this. So here we can see um, this IMG tag, which is for the image. And then very soon, right after the width, we see the alt attribute. And this is where we see the alt text. So it looks like in this case, um, it reads an amendment to the pay transparency law has been introduced in the legislature, etc. This looks like they have just used the caption for that image as the alt text, which is sometimes useful and sometimes redundant if that caption is also included elsewhere. Here's another example with a local news website. Sometimes if, depending on the page structure, it's kind of hard to identify the images through the inspector tool. You can also just look at everything on the whole page by right-clicking anywhere and saying view page source. This is the full HTML behind the page and it can look a little bit intimidating, but what we can do is a controller command F and search for the attribute alt and you can go through that and see these. It'll also pick up words like alternate, um, but we can start to see here that most of the alt tags on this page are blank. Sometimes you want a blank alt tag if it's a purely decorative image, um, but in this case, even the news images have blank alt tags, which is an indication of a missed opportunity. It looks like the CMS is capable of including alt text, but it's not being entered um, by the people updating the website. Here's another example we can look at um, with the website rest of world um, just to see another example of this so we can do it either way i'm going to do the inspect option again so i right clicked on this image chose inspect this one again pulls up the image tag directly and in this case the alt tag is at the end of this code block but we can still see it there the alt attribute and this one is done as true alt text as far as describing what the image is it's kind of a abstract photo illustration and a little bit or not even a photo illustration just a illustration and it's a little bit hard to describe and they describe it this way as a stylized illustration of a large graduation cap with the surface of the cap resembling a semiconductor chip um, and it goes on to talk about the description of this image so that anyone who was looking at this site using a screen reader could have a good sense of what that image shows and its purpose in the article even if they couldn't see the image itself.